Twickenham Stadium is the spiritual home of rugby union and is the largest stadium in the world to be solely devoted to the sport. Steeped in history, it is somewhere players and fans the world over dream of visiting. This match could easily tip in either direction. It'll just need the right spark. Assisting with the analysis in this match is Justin Marshall. And you couldn't ask for better conditions, could you? It's excellent conditions for rugby here. A packed stadium like this really will get the players all fired up. It's hard to pick a winner leading into this. Both teams are pretty evenly matched. It's all set for outstanding rugby. Well, that's our view. So let's see how the game pans out. So, we're about to get going. Here's the kickoff. Puerto takes in the kickoff. He gets crunched to the ground. And they're a bit slow to get there, but here they come. The lock pumps the legs with a good charge. It's a very good run. Decides to have a go himself. Dupont with a nice bend. So, line out to come. English throw. <laughs> Courtney Lords dragged it down nicely. Let's it bounce, but he's gathered it up. It was good. Some really stellar catching. Taken down in a strong tackle there. Completely fools him with the dummy. The 5'8 with a good run. Good work in the ruck by France. Hard and straight. Strong driving defence there. Now the numbers turn up. Dupont gives it off now. It's in touch. English line out ball. Laws is the target. That was a good clean line out. Dead right, Justin. Dylan Hartley looks for options. Farrell on a good run. They bring him down in the end. Yep, it's still on their side. Youngs keeps the ball moving. Past the halfway there. Joseph has support. He's nearly there, what a run! And he's over for their first try. They finally got him into some space and he showed us just how brilliant he can be. Pure entertainment, what a great try. It's very impressive indeed. Yep, that's right Justin. Straight forward kick this one. and walks away. He knows it's over. Very much a tight contest, this one. Still anybody's game, really. The restart. The kickoff snapped up. Pickamall makes the tackle. Ball's been contested and he's pounded into the ground. Good, strong run. The defender can't complete the tackle. Good contest, but it's still theirs. The blindside flanker gets inside the 22. Surging towards the line now. An almost certain try blocked by that huge tackle. Amazing! Real chance here. He's nearly there. What a run. He gets there first. Well, there were some outstanding individual contributions for that try. We've got the kick still to come. 
the first five to level the scores. Kick looks good. Successful conversion, 7-7. Well, you'd have to say, these points are very important to them in this intense battle. It's a tight match. This one could still go either way with the scores square at the end of the first half. It's been a pretty tight sort of a contest as expected. I think so, yeah. And you can see in those hit-ups that they're not afraid to carry the ball forward. So the kickoff is made. Kickoff taken in. Yeah, he took a great catch. He was under all sorts of pressure too, but he handled it well. First well, scrum in the game. Fine. Well, they find themselves under a bit of pressure here, Set. don't they? Oh, it's a good hit. And a good battle going on here. Brutal contest in the scrum. Solid scrum and the ball's out. Then Youngs tried to slip the pass away. Daly is absolutely smashed. Still there, I think. Ben Youngs gathers it out of the back. There's some real force in this defence. May stops him with a nice tackle. He's been hit hard. Looks like we've got an injury. He's hurt his knee. Looks like he's in quite some pain. He didn't want to go off, but I think it's fairly obvious he has to. Let's see how the scrum responds here. Bind. An important defensive scrum here. Set. Pear puts it in. Furious looking scrum down there. Both teams putting pressure on. Ball is out now. A good putt by the number 12. He's well positioned to take that kick. And he's driven back in the tackle. Shut down with a brutal tackle. I think it's there for France. Maynard takes it. Here comes the chase. Big, big charge. Joseph on a searching run. And finally taken to ground now. Somehow he's managed to grab that back. Misses his man. This time he's brought to the ground. He's trying to turn it over quickly. Too powerful for that defender. He's having a go at the ball. Goes to ground quickly. Oh, they've only got a few minutes to make something. Short run through to his support player. Dylan Hartley goes running hard at the opposition. May finds open space with a long run. They take their time getting there. Joseph picks it out of the back, spins it on, goes inside. He puts on a good first. Release. Reef wants him to let go of it. A good pass to his support player. Rather speculative pass. So that's the match and the scores remain all tied up after 80 minutes of hard fought rugby. A good contest between these teams. So it's all square here at the end of the match. They made a lot of tackles. They really put in a huge amount of work. There were quite a number of kicks made in this match. It was a real old fashioned kicking battle. No surprise in the end. A very even contest, Nisbo.